little towels on the sure. end. And then you got to buy those dang things all the time. They don't really mop up anything wet. They're really right. kind of more for like a dry or a dusting. This is called the Quickie Clean Mop, and I will tell you, it's revolutionizing how people clean their floors. Absolutely. Because it, what you have is you have a separate two-bucket system, but it's all in one bucket. The, the clean water and the dirty water never mix, and Peter will show you how that works. Right. But look at how easy. It weighs like a pound in his hand. He can manipulate that brush. Circular yeah. design. Exactly. That mop head is incredible. So you, I, the, why I'm showing that to you, hanging it right there for you, is look how dirty that mop head is. So traditionally, then you would take that mop head, you go back to that bucket, and you rinse right. it in the bucket, right. but then you, you're like, okay, it's rinsed. You take that dirty water and you go back to the floor. What if we could clean that mop head completely, go back to the floor with a clean mop head, never touching that dirty water? So watch this. The bottom of this mop is going to click just like that into that two bucket system. And I'm gonna be able to pump this handle and I'm gonna be able to rinse that mop head and then it's gonna pop up and I'm gonna be able to dry it. Did you see that? Now, we have a clear bucket here for you. This is, you're getting a gray bucket, but I wanted you to see, you're gonna see the dirty water down here. Wow. You see that white bucket inside? That's the clean water. That's clean. We're spraying the clean water onto it. I'm gonna do it again for you. Here we go. So it goes down, look at that. We're rinsing that mop head then it pops up and now you can wring it out so it can be as dry or as wet as you want. <laughs> Look at the dirty water on the bottom there. That was just one rinsing of this mop head. Now, there it is. Oh, a clean mop head. And, and it out. I can feel clean hot water. We actually put warm water in there. And yeah. I can go right back to the floor and start mopping again, which I think is amazing. And, and inside, what happens when Peter puts the mop inside, the water is channeled straight up at that mop head. And so it rinses it. And then by spinning it, it releases the water, which goes yeah. down the sides of the bucket right. and wind up in the bottom. And that's really the magic of the whole thing. This was $39.95. It was a good deal back then, and thousands went out. We dropped the price because we want everybody to get one of these and try it to $24.95. Right. You'll notice it's clean. There's no splashing. There's no mess. You don't have, well, can I do this one, Pete? Yeah, well, can you even see this from where, I'm at, from where I'm at? Can you see that one, Josh? Should I hold it here? Or what should I do? Look at it. I'm showing you this nasty... <laughs> See, yeah, I don't care about Pete. I want you to look at my bucket. I was showing him the good bucket. stuff, guy. Look at that. You want to mop your floor with that? I mean, look at it. Look at this. That's what most people do. You don't have to do it like that. You can do it the smart way. I got, yeah. well, as soon as Peter brought this out, when he did, I bought one of these. Because um, I, I don't have, I mean, I've got a, most of my house is hard floors, right? Right. I've got tile, I've linoleum, I've, I have marble in the bathroom, all that stuff which you can, which you can wash. But to try to get the traditional mop out to do that in a small house was a nightmare. I wasn't even doing it. Well, so many of us want to get the floors actually really clean. Yeah. And if you're putting that dirty water back on, like I was showing you, you're putting it back on the floors, you're never really getting it clean. So let me show you exactly how that bucket system works, that bucket inside the bucket. So as I was mentioning, we have the the clear bucket for you to see that. But I'll show you down here that yeah. this is a gray bucket that you're getting. So look at this, they've designed everything perfectly. I can lift out, I'm just Get that out of there, there we go. So that's the inner There's bucket, the clean look at that. Water. This is all you carry to the sink and you're going to fill that up. And you see it's got a little lid on there. It's got this little plastic lid. Yep. So I'll push that back down on there. So now when I drop that in here, I fold those handles down. So when I'm rinsing the mop, the mop, this is incredible how this works, a great piece of engineering. It's spraying water up onto that mop head as it spins and then the water will run down over this, not getting into the clean water, over, down into our large bucket, which is going to be the dirty water. And look at this, a separate handle. I take this, you've got that pour spout, and I'm gonna dump out that dirty water when I'm finished mopping. It is amazing. That clean water and the dirty water, they never mix. You're gonna love it. Putting this together is super easy. And also on hsn.com, there's a full how-to video. If you have any questions, you can watch that yeah. video. It shows you exactly how to do this. Let's show everybody what they yeah, get, yeah. too. Can we do that really quick, and we'll show you the video afterwards. So when you order, as Peter said, you're going to get the gray bucket. We have the clear one there. That's just to show you how it works inside. But you oh, know, yeah. It's working. You don't need to see that. You get the bucket. We, these pads are amazing because we <laughs> reuse these, right? right? We, don't, we don't throw these you away. You get three. You're going to be able to put these in the wash a hundred times a piece. And what you see here is these little scrubby stripes. So that's going to be great to really get those tough stains uh, if it's in the, the grout of your tile work, gotcha. things like that. Right. And then we have the fringe out there. That's going to be really nice if you have any additional liquid. It's going to absorb all that. Throw them in the wash. But it's great that you're going to have a clean mop head every time you go back to the floors. And then in between that, you're going to wash them so they're going to be fresh and new. So three of those and here's the other great part you mentioned those other kind of mopping systems that you can buy where you put the reusable stuff and then you throw yeah, them out yeah. and they always come off then they're falling
falling off all the time. This will not come off. We've got all these little hooks around here that are, they're, they're easy on and off, but it means that that mop head's not gonna come off. There's also the hook and loop closure underneath there as well, so you are gonna love that. Now I wanna show you one other thing. This also has the ability, look at this, this will automatically bend and it will clean your baseboards Smart. or your toe kick underneath your kitchen cabinets. This is an amazing system. So I've got to keep mopping, guy. I want to show yeah, everyone again. Yeah, you got again. a lot of mess to clean up here. Yeah, Pete. I'll do some more of these just so you can see again. Dirty mop head, we go to the bucket, we clean it, we put clean water back on the floor. And you know what's nice too is again, there's not the big heavy nasty weight that you have on a big old uh, mop, mop and bucket. Right. Um, you're not breaking your back trying to deal with that thing. Um, and it's super absorbent. Peter will actually be able to do all of this floor or, uh, without even having to hit the bucket. He's doing the entire thing. Shows you how super absorbent these are. Yeah. It's also great on any type of floor, and we'll get into the different floors that we're gonna clean. So whether you have tile, whether you have a linoleum, uh, maybe you've got a hardwood floor, a laminate floor, whatever it is, it works on it. And you can use it just mildly damp on a wood floor, which sure. is important. Well, well, here, I'll show you that again. When, it, when this pops up, now you can wring it out as much as you want by continuing to spin that. Get it as dry as yeah, you want. Yeah, as dry it. as you want. Yeah, yeah, you can wring that out. So I was cleaning that mop pad there. You can see it's spraying that water on there. So when you go back to that floor, you now have that clean mop pad. You can put hot water in there as we've done here, but I'm using just water. You can also decide to put your, your floor cleaner in there. Sure. If you want it to smell nice, a little pine cleaner, you can do that as well. And then it stands up on its own. <laughs> I'm gonna keep moving down here. You mentioned yep. hardwood floors. I should do one well, of those this, as well. The, well we done is we've put together our four different types of floors here so because I want you to know this is universal you can use it on anything it's also great for dusting or cleaning if you also want to do shower floors or or the inside of a tub because it's relatively you know has that flexibility and it moves very easily it'll go in and around almost anything you saw how it easily went around the, the commode there or the base of it yes I said commode uh, <laughs> well, that's still early to say toilet um, anyway Pete so yeah you can go anywhere but as a dusting mop I want you to look here because this is a hardwood floor. And you know that hardwood floors get that. It, it's, it's almost like I have dark granite countertops in my bathroom and the dust just gets you know everywhere inside there. This is a way to be able to clean that. And do you see how that dust just sticks to that mop pad? It, look at that. The mop pad, it, I mean, it's fantastic. So you can get that shine. But just imagine how quickly you could clean that floor with this mop. And then let's go up to this other floor because this one has just a bunch of scuff marks. But you know, not only is it the scuff marks, I want you to see this. I was mentioning a moment ago, when you're getting into those areas under the baseboard, um, under the cabinets, what you can do is just, let me get that in there. Pop that in there just like <clears> that. <throat> I've got a, and now look at that. Yeah, how that will awesome. just go right up <laughs> there. So see, the I don't baseboards, know how else I would do that, Pete. Exactly, but just the baseboards around the entire house, it's fantastic, look at that. That I thought was genius that they did that. But even these scuff marks, this does such a great job on scuff marks. This is a linoleum floor, but tile floors and hardwood floors. But you are finally getting it actually really clean because you're no longer spreading all that dirt from the bucket. Look at that. The dirty yeah. water doesn't mix with the clean water. It's amazing, this mop. Look well, at that. It's, it's like every time you put your mop in that bucket, you're washing it at the same time. And when you think about what we used to do with the string mops and things like that, I mean, essentially, once you used your mop once, it was never gonna be clean again, right? You're basically <laughs> right. just recycling the old water. And you, and you know towards the end the, that you, you know, you're putting pretty much water that's the color of soup uh, back onto the surfaces that you have, uh, which is nasty. So if you wanna get that, that really nice squeaky clean floor, and you wanna do it in a realistic way, because yeah. let's face it, you know, you're gonna put that job off, uh, off forever if it's really hard for you to do. It's kinda like washing exterior windows. It's like you don't like to do it. Um, if it was an easy way to do it, you would. That's why a lot of people buy pressure washers because it makes it life easy. But then you gotta pull the pressure washer out. This is easy. It's right there. It only weighs, what does it weigh, a pound in your hand maybe? Exactly, very, very light, light in your, in your yeah. hand. And it really does such a great job. So if you're someone who wants to get those floors as clean as possible, you want to do it the easiest possible way, this is it. That mop pad looks great again. I can feel that fresh, warm water on there and I'm gonna go right back to that floor. I'm not spreading that dirt 
you know, you've cleaned your floors. You don't want to take what you've just cleaned, that dirt, and put it back on the floor. That's what this mop is doing. This is the first mop that can actually say that, that we're not actually mixing that clean water with the dirty water and then putting it back on the floors. It does such a great job. I'll switch it, with you guys. It really is. And, you know, we have wonderful, uh, like, floor cleaners, like big industrial carpet cleaners. Right. They have the separate tanks. Those are $150, $200 machines, and they just work on carpets. This is your hard floor cleaner that's gonna get to the, to the root of the problem, which is makes it easy. It's easy to fill the bucket, take it over to your sink. A lot of people will even just put a little vinegar in there. You know, if you wanna go natural clean, you can sure. do that. Peter said, heck, you know, you don't even really need anything in there at all. You can just yeah. use hot water. Um, if maybe you've got some of our uh, cleaners that we have here uh, that you wanna put a little of that in there, you can do it and you can see the amount of dirt. And remember, yeah. That pad, and, that was nasty. Pete. And that was, was a clean right floor. Camera's face. Yeah. <laughs> because what, what I was showing you We believe you, here, you, Pete. It's dirty. That this was what looked to be a clean floor. And that's kind of what you, we see at home. You know, you don't always see all these kind of big, obvious messes at home. You see your floor, and you don't know how dirty it is until you take a mop like this to it. So let's go to that bucket. It snaps on. And then all you're doing is pushing down. So three times we'll go, and then it pops up. And that gives you the ability to wring it out. Now, if I just pull up a little bit, I can go back down and rinse it some more, and then it's gonna pop up and I can wring it out. And I love the clear bucket. Look at that. What I just showed you that we were able to take off that floor, rinse off the mop head, went down over that inner bucket of the clean water, and down into that clear bucket. You're it's gonna get a gray a cool. bucket, but it's so neat for you to see that. You will see that at home. This is unlike any other mop Look system out there. Look at the animation there. here too, Pete. Explain that. It's spraying water up onto that mop head as it's spinning, as you're pumping down on the handle, cleaning that mop head. And watch how that dirty water goes around, yeah. over the top, into that outer bucket and it never mixes with that clean, fresh water, with so that clean smart. detergent in there, whatever you want. So have a look. Is it clean? God, is that clean? Wait, so I'm not gonna Isn't put that? my face on it, but yeah, it looks pretty I'll dang clean. I'll push it into the camera again. Pretty clean, But now Pete. it's clean. It's, I mean, I was blown away when I first saw this, and using it, this is exactly what happens. You're amazed at how much dirt gets on there, especially when you see a clean floor. Then, just quick and easy, you clean that mop head, you go back to the floor with a clean mop head with clean water. Again, unlike any other mopping system out well, there. Well, yeah, and that, the whole idea behind getting something clean is to obviously get it really clean. <laughs> Right. And you can't do that if you're fun, if you're just recycling old old buck, mop water in the bucket. That's just nasty. Yeah, <laughs> I can't. I could barely even say that. Well, think about it. So you're not going to use the same towel over and over and over when you get out of the shower. That's basically what you're doing. You're just using the same dirty water to try to clean the floor. You don't want to do that. You want to have it be nice and clean and truly clean. And that's the idea. You're going to be mopping your floors a lot less because you're going to get them really clean. Right. If you have the worst, I think the worst. You know, it's funny. You think the worst room in everybody's house is the bathroom, but oh, the worst yeah. room, the worst room in our house, ours is the kitchen. You spend the most time there. Yeah. Right? I mean, yeah. You, know, you get, you know, plus you're cooking food. In there, gets on the floor, you spill stuff, sauce, all these different things. Um, you know, around there, usually your, your kitchen also has its refrigerator in there, so there's stuff that falls out of there. It's the dirtiest, probably the dirtiest floor in the house, and probably the one that's the hardest to clean. You could probably clean any, any kitchen floor in five minutes with this thing. Exactly. Because remember, all I'm doing, I went to the floor, you saw me do this tile floor, we had a lot of sticky messes and different Pete. color things on there. But look at that, it's, you're able to clean it just pumping that handle, that's all you have to do. You like that? Oh, okay. Keep, yeah, you know some of that. I, I got more be messes over you, here. I, I, it's so lightweight in your hand. Anybody out there that has issues with your hands, maybe you've got, you know, a little arthritis or whatever, and, you, and it's hard for you to hold on to things, you should really try this because it is so lightweight and comfortable. Um, and all you need to do is just apply a little bit of pressure when you're trying to, uh, when you're cleaning your floors, that's all that you need to do. Um, and it moves and glides around anything. So if you're doing, uh, you know, like we said, the toilet area, or if you're doing around your, around, uh, you know, your, your uh, sink in your, in your kitchen, you know, where you get a lot of drippy water, it's perfect for that. Or if you just need to mop up spills and stuff like that, it's perfect. Yeah, I've been really impressed with the mop head. I like the round mop head. I like that fringe on the outside. And then those real, those scrubby stripes, they do such a great job. And there actually, you can see the mechanism. That's what hooks onto the top of that, that bucket where it now spins and then sprays that water onto this mop head, rinsing it out, giving you that clean mop head. Not just a clean mop head when you start mopping. This is a clean mop head the whole time you're mopping. So, guy, you know what you want, if you want to, because I know you do. What you you can do me? that. You can do that mess, and you then gonna, you can. You're gonna bring it out. Work oh, I wanted to show everyone what I'm doing here. Is this is one wet already or you, no? It's just yeah, a little bit of water on it. 
You can tighten that handle when you're mopping. So what I do is I turn that so it locks it into place. When you're gonna use the handle to clean it, you loosen it and you can see how that handle allows you to pump it up and down. God, you just did the whole thing. Well, I thought you were gonna do half and I was gonna nah, do half. Nah, I might as well do it all while I'm no, here. No, I got a little bit here. You were sitting there talking and you wouldn't stop, so I just figured that I might as well get out there, I might as well, well start I, cleaning I wanna, it up. I gotta Look put a little dirt on my You're mop working head. really hard, I'm hardly working at all. So Look at I this. can show how to clean it. I'm just doing my one-handed. Look at me. That's yeah, just but, crazy. So there we go, I wanna show that dirty mop head. Remember what you do with your mop right now. You take it back to the bucket, you rinse that out, but that's it. No more clean water when you rinse that out because now everything is basically, got, it's contaminated. So mm -hmm. now you loosen that handle, yeah. just this bottom piece right there. Oh, I got you. Yep. Mm. Am I doing it right? Hold that. You'll oh, feel I got it. you, there I see, you go. I see. Hold the top piece, yeah, now you watch. just loosen it. Yeah, now you, Yeah. so now pump that down. Oh, you gotta go high, there, there, there you go. Oh, you know what's funny? I was able to see that first pump when you did it, all the dirty water splashed Dude, off I'm that. I'm killing it. It is fantastic. That's it? So three pumps and you'll see that it pops up. Now, if you want to go back down, you just pull, give it a little, tiny little pull up and then go back down. Nope, just from the hand. Oh, I got you. Yeah, and it'll go back down and rinse it again. That's amazing. No. Come here. What? Like this. Oh, now, now it's I got it. <laughs> oh, that's easy. <laughs> All right. There's and then, a, now, there's, now, look at that. This was a, we we uh, changed this bucket out. That was completely clean, guy. All that water was not in there. That is the dirty water. That's what was on this mop head. To me, that is what's so amazing about this system. It wow. really is incredible. And all, all right. I feel on there is that really warm, clean water. Go back to the floor, and you can now mop with a clean mop. All right, bed. I'm going to run over to our next studio. Peter's going to wrap up here. Remember, grab it. We'll tell you everything that you get. It's a great way to be able to mop up your floors. And for my money, Pete, I'm telling you, you go over what they get one more yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, definitely. It's a great deal. So we're getting, here you can see that bucket in the bucket system. What we're doing there is clean water in that inner bucket. Then that goes in that outer bucket. That's where all the dirty water is gonna go up and over the clean water, down into that outer bucket so the two are never going to mix. And that's what makes this mopping system completely different than anything else you've tried. Every time you go to the floor, you've got a clean mop head. So you're really getting things clean. And what we're getting today is you're gonna get your mop system. You're gonna get the two bucket system. You are also going to get three mop heads. You're gonna wash these over and over again, over a hundred times each. This is the mopping system that's going to get your floors as clean as possible. I am going to join Guy in our other studio for our streak free cloths guy are you there yeah i'm there pete thank you buddy yes so we're going to continue to clean we've kind of shown you uh how you can clean it in and around the house especially when it applies to your floors so any kind of a hard floor uh whether it's your tile and onion glass wood now when you're cleaning the rest of the house a lot of you probably use either that nasty rag that you kind of recycle or maybe you use paper towels or whatever please let me uh, tell you about these, uh, the Autosmith um, Streak Free Cloths. These are the most amazing cloths you will ever see. Uh, whether you are cleaning, polishing, doing windows, interior, exteriors of your automobile, anywhere around your house, any job, any mess, and any surface, these work amazingly. These are a blend of materials that are completely lint-free and you can use them on any surface. They're safe to use on any surface. They're not gonna scratch anything. You can use them uh, dry, you can use them them wet you can use them in yep. conjunction with whatever cleaners you like uh, you use them over and over it's a nine pack of these claws and you can wash them out and clean absolutely them and use them again yeah. For me, and I mean, you were looking at these, I want everyone, you know, to not get confused. This is not, you know, doesn't it look like just an ordinary, maybe a shop it's towel that right. you would get? It's not. This is a pressed fiber where they heat this up and they press it together. So it's no ordinary microfiber. Now, I think the best way to use these is to use them wet. So you you rinse it, you wring it out really good. So feel that guy, just just tiny bit damp. Yeah, yes. And then you can use these without using chemicals at all. So you'll be able to use that, you know, you can fold it however you want and you can start to use these anywhere all around especially a glass top stove like this it is the best this is going to work perfectly on glass on mirrors it's going to work even on chrome and stainless all those different areas now even with this you'll see I wanted to show you so this this gets dirty you're gonna be amazed at how I can just go to the sink rinse this out again wring it out right. and it basically keep going and then after a while if you want to wash them you can wash them in the washing machine and keep going so 
you know, how much, how many of these are you going oh my through? Gosh. I mean, we go through so the many of these papers. Of that a week, right? Easily exactly. You're cleaning around the house. I mean, I don't mind these for around my kitchen sink when I'm just, you know, when I want to uh, take a mess and throw it away, pick something up, a broken egg. You know what I mean? Like, right. But for every day, you're wasting so much money. Exactly. On and they do a great job. Windows, mirrors, unbelievable. You can wet this, wring it out, and you can do an entire set of windows. You don't have to spray anything. You don't have to keep going back and forth. Guy, I'm going to give you this one that's okay. dry because here's when you want to use them dry and it's amazing. Tablets, your television, your computer screen, your glasses. glasses. Go ahead. Yeah. I'm giving it to you. Oh, you're giving me the clean? <laughs> Making or is you actually clean. Giving, is this a holiday gift for me? You're giving me <laughs> yes, a tablet? Too. Oh my but, gosh, I mean, look. Can you it's see? fantastic if you, you use it dry on those. Your glasses, whether it's your sunglasses or your eyeglasses, wow. use it dry. So all the electronics, you use it dry. And then, again, tile glasses while and here, glass. Please. All those things, it works so well when you're using it wet. Because what you're doing is you're not using it wet, you're wringing it out. It's just barely damp. And it's not letting enough water onto this towel after you wring it out to leave all those streak marks, to leave all those uh, those those spots. This is gonna be lint-free yeah. as well. If you if you come in really close, you can see the weave on this. That's why it's uh, it's completely lint-free. Nothing is gonna come off of these. Yeah, that's unlike paper. Pressed. Paper towel's made of paper. Paper's made of pulp, and pulp will disintegrate and it leaves residue. That's what it does. And a lot of your cotton claws and things like that will leave right. a leftover material. You know, they leave a little bit of what we call lint. These don't have that. The way they're made, they, they, they completely clean without leaving any residue at all. So there's so many options, wet and dry, but also, if you want to use a spray cleaner, if you have that favorite right. cleaner to clean your car, same thing. They're going to work perfectly with that as well. So however you want to use these towels, the best thing about it is you're not throwing money in the trash by using those paper towels over and over again. So whether you spray the cleaner right on the towel and then you're using it in those areas like the car, it is going to be amazing. I want to go and do over this. and over. Yeah, I want to do this window that okay, sure. over here. Because I think the glass demonstration is the yeah. best demonstration that we do. If you buy these just to clean your windows or maybe it's your shower stalls or whatever it is, this yeah, mirrors is, can we tell how nasty, can we see how nasty, yeah, we can see it when you look, look at how nasty that is. I should have got uh, you one for you. See, you I wore do, a dark shirt because I know, hat. So, I know TVs and I should wear dark, <laughs> unlike Mr. Pattern guy over here. Now, but, but look at, look at how clean that's well, getting. What, what I like about this is when you're using this, and I, I wanted to show just one half, because yeah. I can use this and then, what you're gonna do is, I'm gonna turn it over. I'm drying for you. Well, you don't, you don't need, well, you're no, choosing a dry one now. Look at, look at, look Cause at. I, what I wanted to point out is, yeah. so even when you see a little bit of that wet on there, because I'm not, this isn't super wet, you just wait a few seconds and you're out. gonna start to see all the hand look marks it. go away. Look all at the this, before and after be, on it's gonna, the <laughs> it's gonna be streaked. Look, there's right, the before and side. after, look. Before. And after. I'm scared. <laughs> no, that's the magic of television. But it, it yeah. really is, it's, it's amazing what you can do with this without using chemicals. So think about that. Yeah. All the spray that you use for windows and glass, mirrors, this is gonna be that glass top stove. There it is on the electronics, and then throw it in the wash. Yeah, use them but, again and again. But when they get dirty, I think you're gonna be amazed how when you run them under the water in the sink, you rinse them out, you wring them out, and then you use them again. <laughs> All right. You get nine of these for $15.95, marked down from 22. They're on FlexPay for about three bucks. Uh, if you do work around the house or work around the car, or the garage or whatever, I just said, I do, my glasses have never been this clean and I got no dirt on them, <laughs> never. no lint on them anyway. Lint free, uh, streak free. Totally, 593-489 is the item number. Grab them while you can. As I said, they're continuing to be on FlexPay and they are on clearance like everything else. We got anything else for you, Pete? I'm not right now, I'll be All back right. at noon. Will Beetle. you be here? All right. Pete will be back at noon. No, I won't be here. I'm on vacation. What? I'll be really? I'll be in another place somewhere. Wow. We'll be right back. <laughs> Welcome to Generation Wow. For over 75 years, HP has been the leader in innovation, pioneering technology through cutting-edge products and forward-thinking solutions. HP makes life better for everyone, everywhere. From laptops and desktops to monitors and printers, the visionaries at HP create experiences that amaze. Let their experts help you reinvent how you work, play, and live. HP and HSN. Keep reinventing. Only on HSN. 
HSM Cares is dedicated to empowering women and helping families in times of need. We partner with St. Jude Children's Research Hospital so that families never receive a bill from St. Jude because all a family should worry about is helping their child live. This year marks HSN's ninth annual HSN Cares Designer Ornament Collection, including over 25 exclusive ornaments designed by some of your favorite HSN personalities. With the purchase of every ornament, HSN Cares will donate $5 to St. Jude. All right, so do you have this problem in your cabinets, right? There's stuff all over the place. How many, okay, let me ask you this. How many paprikas do you have? If you have like five paprikas, then you are totally out of control when it comes to what's in your cabinets. And you need, because I've done that. I'm like, there's, why do I have so much paprika in here? And all I put it on is deviled eggs and, and potato salad, yet I have tons of them. It's because you can't keep track of the stuff. We've got this uh, storage rack system from our friends at Storesmith um, that actually has a swivel design. Once you use this, you'll be wondering you'll, to yourself, like, how did I ever not have this before? And whether it's medications or spices or whatever it is that you need to store, this does it. You're gonna get a two pack of these storage racks. They're half price today, only $12.95. And look at how, how easily they fit right into the cupboard. And guess who's back? Ah, see, I knew you'd be back. <laughs> yes. Alexandra Baker is here with us and uh, everybody. So uh, you have your choice of colors. They come in a variety. We've got uh, black, red, tan. Am I right? I don't see tan, tan out no. here, so tan's gone. Tan. Okay. It says tan, does it say tan right there? Yeah. All right, black, red, white. Uh, this is blue. It's a teal. Uh, purple. And navy, even though it's a very purple navy. navy. Okay, mm -hmm. and then the white. white. All right. And then this is grapefruit. This is an exciting color, grapefruit. Oh, that's a different like color a than the red. And okay. this is red, yes, yes. All right. Now, the reason why I'm up front really quickly, I want to show you. In, in what's most important here is that it's got the footed bottoms right here. So you're receiving a set of two. It's got the little feet right here that you can remove the adhesive. You can secure it on the shelf that you have in your home if you want to. And then you can slide this out. I've got this here. You can just slide this out and now you can see what you have. You can put it like this and then you can close it and you can swivel it like this and then you can pull this one out the same way and now you can see, oh, I only have two vanillas and one almond. I'm not out of the extract. Right. And this is what you were talking about is that sometimes you've got too many of one because you simply cannot see. You know, sometimes when it's just so simple and easy, it escapes us, but this is a solution for a problem of having one shelf that has all of the bottles going all the way across, and now right. you've got two levels, and you've got that rotating bottom, uh, that swiveling bottom that's going to let you have easier access. Yes. It's plastic, it's lightweight, but they're ideal for the bathroom, the kitchen, the garage, the craft room, even yeah. on your desk. This is fantastic. Oh, well, and, and you can put them in any, they go into any cabinet or any cupboard, and this is how they work. You don't have to mount them or fix them to anything. I guess you, if you wanted to, you could probably, you know, get some sticky stuff and put it on to make them, you know, put them in one place it, permanent. It comes with them. Does it, it come with that? Put it. Yes, it comes so, with the so, adhesive. So you can you can actually make it permanent. But you know, things like just uh, prescription medicines, things like crafts. Um, so obviously, we know the little mini spice things, which is the ones you buy because how much apple pie spice do you really need? Um, <laughs> so you buy the small ones, and until you forget where it is, and then you buy the other one, uh, like I've done. Like I said, Excuse with me, mine, baby. it was the dang paprika. <laughs> just, I, Too much know, paprika? You know, you, well, no, not enough apparently for me to keep track of it. Right. Um, so, but it, what happens is also is it falls out of um, the because I have a, I have a. a pantry thing that goes around my um my where my oven is on the sides and that's what i where i put those little things in but if something falls and it goes behind the, the pull out slide you can't reach it with your hand so it just not. lives there and i'm like i'll just get another one until i get the tongs or the big ruler and try to pull stuff out but it gets it gets lost this keeps everything very organized it's very organized you know sometimes i share products with you as your home bff and i and they'll send me the sample and store smith is hsn's exclusive collection of really tools and ideas that are going to help you with organizing they're going to help you with storage they're really going to be a solution they're unique they're clever, they're creative, and they're usually very simple solutions. This is a solution when you can easily reach your prescription medicine. When you have the tools, the nails, the little bits, the little, those little pieces, it seems like they are forever appearing in your home, right? right. But you've gotta have a place to actually house them so that you can see what you have. I mean, this is simple enough. This one's yeah. in black. You can just put this. I love so how it smart. swivels. I can see if I have yeah. nails in here. I can see if I have uh, the contact type of uh, tape that I can use. And so very easy. It's the simple solution that you're looking for. 
Get a couple for the garage. Well, you get two, which you is nice. You get two, right? So if you want to buy more than one set, uh, that's not a that's not a bad idea either, right? You like not you said, put them in your garage. If you've got like I actually have a, a, sh a tool shed. You see the ma makeup that in I here. could put this on a on you know just on a couple of, of the racks that I have in there. Well, yeah, ladies, what about all your makeup or your or your uh, nail polish and things like that? You which, can line up the polishes. Right? You can line everything up because sometimes it's those products that we're reaching for all the time that we may not right. want to put away. You can even keep this countertop, and I've got all my Too Faced. Uh, product right here. My It Cosmetics has just arrived. I can keep that here. It's just the right size. All of my favorite uh, lipsticks and 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 uh, product lip colors that I can use. Very simple. In the office, you'll probably keep this on your desk. I love this vibrant color. This this great yeah, let's, color. Let's should we go through colors one last time before we wrap it up? We have two in the red. So red. This is teal. Teal. Black. Black. Uh, we're calling this like a bronze. It's, it's bronze, a bronze brown, but it's really it's really a brown. The, the pink grapefruit there. Okay. Here's uh, another red. Red. Okay. Purple. Now plum, and we have navy, me. but the navy is very plum. purple. Okay. They're calling it plum. They're calling and it then plum. The purple. And Whatever I say, they're calling it something else. It's slightly That's different, right? That's pretty much how you can. <laughs> and it's a little bit more vibrant. And <laughs> then right. we have the white as well. All right. Grab them all you can. Five four four two zero seven. Two dollars and fifty nine cents on flex. But you can't go wrong. Thank you again, Alexandra. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. We're gonna move on, and we're gonna talk about. Let's talk about. Should we talk about clogged drains, or what are we talking about? All right, so let's talk about clog drains for a minute, all right? Now, there's a lot of ways you can deal with a drain. You can go get some stuff, and, uh, you know, you got all kinds of gook in there, and you can pour it down the drain. You can wait a couple hours, whatever. In the meantime, that's not helping you get out of the house, right? That's not helping you get your shower going. Uh, you want instant results, and I mean, bang, instant results? You know what you need? You need the MagnaTools Air Pressure Drain Blaster using the power of compressed air and you do it yourself and you don't have to pour nothing nasty and you know chemically like this stuff right here you don't have to do that this one in fact you pour this one down a drain it makes smoke have you ever seen that because it's an acid and so that's eating all the stuff it's just a little bit nasty uh this this product which has been here for several years it's a really it's a, a tried and proven product um is on sale today it's normally thirty dollars and 95 cents and today it's only 17.95 this will pay for itself many times over the first time you don't have to call a plumber right what you're going to get in the kit is you get the air compressor and it's a little pistol uh trigger air compressor right here and all you do is you give it a little couple of pumps this is the pump right here and then you pull the trigger and what it does is it takes the compressed air and it fires it through one of the adapters down the drain thusly clearing and vacating all the debris out of the pipes so that you can get back to the business of whatever it is you were doing in the first place. My friend Matt Davis is here. Hi, yo, man. And when hey, you everybody. see, hi buddy, when you see the demonstrations, I mean, prepare to be wowed. And, and not only that, it's fun. Come love, on, you I know love, this is fun I to know use. It is. I, I, it's like I pulling a tree. It's like a gun, show. like a cannon. That's and it's, right. Yeah, so anyway. So it, let's it's talk always about Christmas it. morning. It's always Christmas afternoon that you get a clog in your drain. Uh, no matter what, it's never when it's easy. You always have the clog at the worst time. So what do you do? You go reach for this. Well, first of all, I don't want this in my kitchen sink. Nasty. Second of all, you're going up and down, and this is not going to make any difference. This is not going to get the job done. But look at this, with Magna Tools, watch this. All we're gonna do is we're gonna give it eh, eight to 10 pumps. Okay. A real man like Luca Caputo could probably do 12 well, pumps. Well, it's Luca Caputo. But look at this, here's what so, we've done. We've already made a clog down the clog here. Down, look at the clog. There's the clog down here's there. Here's me, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna press it down. I'm gonna go three, two, one, boom! Oh. Look at that, it's gone, that's it. Now look, here's the beauty of it. If it's if air, it's free. <laughs> the air is free. All you're gonna do, like if I wanna pour a little bit more liquid down there, there. Yeah. Look at that. And I think it's already pretty much cleared. But yeah, watch. you did. If I want to pull the trigger again. again, three, two, one, boom, it's wow. gone. That's it. That's how easy and quick it is to clean the clog from your kitchen sink, from your That's commode, fun. or from your shower. That's why I said it was fun. And again, like you say, yeah. it's not this. It's not a spray. Look, pour. Wait 15 minutes, yeah, I know. flush, do not breathe, run out of the house. This is not the kind of thing you need around your house, around your kids, around your family. Well, it's an instant solution. And a yep. lot of us, like, you know, like if you are you have slowly uh, moving water uh, in your shower stall, yep. uh, there's nothing grosser than, uh, even though it's you, standing in your own soup. It's no fun, right? So this is a way to clean it. We give you several different 
um, uh, adapters because we know that some are going to have to go down a smaller drain. Obviously, if you have a uh, you know if you have a, a, a toilet, that's a bigger one. We have the adapter that fits over that, all of which focuses the air pressure down the hole and to the mess where it is. So if you are sick and tired of dealing with this stuff and pouring this stuff, utilize this. Let me show you uh, the, uh, again the kit one more time so you know exactly what you get. A variety of different connectors. Now all these different connectors, like so you know obviously this one that's gonna that's for your toilet right mm -hmm. so you can see which ones fit um, smaller drains even the, the tinier drain sinks and, and kitchen sinks we're even giving you the little snake uh, yes. that's included to get some of the hair on fact Matt you're gonna show oh, everybody that, this is right not, this is not my favorite demonstration you know it's kind of but you know what it happens hair happens my friend even if you're somebody of like guys advanced age sometimes hair starts I to fall will. Don't out make me come Look, over you put here. that down there and you just give it a little bit of a give twist it a turn and look at that, give it a twist, and it's gonna grab that hair, and look at that, I think there's a hamster in here. That's pretty look at nasty. That. And it pulls that hair up, and pulls it up out of the sink, and now you can now. grab it, look at yeah. that. There you go. It's ideal, and, and realistically, that's where the, yeah, I know mm -hmm. Lou, right? It's he's not, gotta do that at the end of my, I've been working three hours, he's gotta pull the, the little mouse out of the <laughs> trap. Um, but anyway, uh, we have a minute left. You wanna make one more drink? I'm gonna make one more mess. So we're gonna show you, and he's gonna make it a lot worse than you would. Yeah, he's actually using paper, paper towels, towels, lettuce. Uh, I mean, normally you're gonna have little bits and pieces that aren't plunger. gonna be that hard to get out. Look, he's even stuffing it in with a get stick. Get in there. Um, but this is using compressed air, a couple of pumps, and that's all you need to do. And then it's gonna, it's gonna blast that thing right through put a little liquid in there watch yeah. how it works and here it is think about it you're cooking for your friends and family and look at this now you've you got, got a backed up starting drain. to back up what did you call it earlier you're you're in your own soup or something well, that's what it feels again, like when you're in the tub and it, you're if you're that's using nasty. this all you're doing is you're moving a little bit of air up and down but with the drain blaster look at this all you do you pump it about five six seven eight nine 10 pumps. Come on now. Here, let me grab this. Sorry, I got the wrong one. <laughs> one more time. See, Lou Caputo would have done this right the first time. Lou, he's out of breath. Lou's come up. <sighs> you might have I'm to come over, Lou. I'm winded. All right, Look, watch. Ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. <laughs> Boom. Oh, I blew it away. <laughs> nice. We got it done. Lettuce in my hair. Lettuce in You're your hair. You're not supposed to get your... Lettuce. We're looking. We're all looking over I'm like this. I'm trying to hurry. <laughs> Dude, Take that your was time. Awesome. It's great. Hey, it gets but those, the drain. Look at that. The, the drain, drain is clear, is clear. my friends. Ah, uh, that is. I, and I'm you can have you. fun with this on New you Year's Day. You want to be a hero so. in your house? Grab one Blow of these. Blow out your candles. All right, be careful now. What the? All right, we'll be right back with the best value of the day. Luke Caputo, coming your way next. <laughs> the thing I love most about shopping at HSN. Do I have to pick just one? I'd have to say flex pay. Mm -hmm. It allows me to get the things I want now and make monthly payments without any interest or fees. I got a new mattress for the guest bedroom, a fabulous cookware set for my sister's wedding, and a little something just for me. FlexPay gives me the flexibility to buy what I need now without the stress of having to pay for it all at once and no interest. Beat that layaway. <laughs> Don't miss a thing with our HSN app, available on Apple and Android devices. Shop faster than ever with product videos, watch HSN live anytime, anyplace, and get $10 off your first in-app purchase with code WELCOME10. Opt in to push notifications for early access to exclusive app-only deals, and the shop and search features make finding your favorites easier than ever. Search app on hsn.com to download. So we saved something very special as we're winding down the uh, the time here at HSN for the year, and it's our origami. If you've never heard of this product before, I'm telling you, and you've never purchased with us before, this is probably one of the best first time purchases you could ever make because it's everything we're about, right? Making things easy on you, doing it at an affordable price, giving you great deals, uh, and really stuff that you can really use. And origami has been doing this for years and years and years. Uh, the reason we do a two pack of these is because every single time we present it as a single pack, everybody says, I wish I, 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 well, they'll either buy two or they get it home and say, I wish I bought two. So we offer you the two 
impact because the shipping is more affordable for you to be able to get it home. So what exactly is this? It's the ultimate storage solution. And I don't care where you use it or what you use it for, you will, you will love this thing. So whether it's a pantry rack for you, a pie rack for you, whether you use it to keep your odds and ends in in your garage, in your shed, use it in your attic, ladies use it for shoes or boots, whatever, planters, indoors, outdoors, whatever you use it for, just know this thing is ruggedly made. When you look at the reviews, and the last time I checked, there were 1,853 five-star reviews out of like 2,000. They're almost all five-star reviews. Why? Because yep. it works. Uh, you heard me talking about my friend, Lou Caputo. You can't have origami out here without my buddy, Lou. And, I'm, and the price is great because normally we were doing one of these for like 60 or $70. Yep. We're doing two for 89. And talk to everybody. First of all, Although they look, you know, they're like they're easy to port around, these things are strong. No, they really are. Tiny but powerful yes. is what we like to say. When you look at this, I'll give you the dimensions right off the top. These are just about three feet, about 35 and a half inches this way, about 13 and a half inches that way. They stand about 35, actually 29 and a half this way, 13 and a half that way, 35 and a half tall. So you're talking about something that's a nice compact size that you can right. put anywhere. But here's the thing about these. These are made of powder coated steel, okay? So what that means is they can hold a lot of weight. With the wheels on it, as you see right here, you can do 75 pounds per shelf for a total of 225 pounds. Now, you don't have to put the wheels on it because when you get this home, it comes flat packed in a box like this. Look at that. You don't have to put the wheels <laughs> on it. But if you do put the wheels on this, then you can go up to 250 pounds on each one of these shelves for a total so, so, of 750 pounds. So wheels pounds. off 750 pounds. Wheels off 750. Now, you just saw how I collapsed this. That, that, that is the way it's gonna come to your house. Flat packed, both of them, just like this. Just the you wheels. Grab the sides, all you do is put the wheels just on Just the wheels. Yeah. They even, give the you back, a, they even give you the wrench for the wheels. For the last couple of turns, <laughs> look right here on the back, there's the world famous origami toggle. Push that down, it locks it. I'm gonna spin this forward. And then on top, right here, there's one more latch. You just let that drop into place, boom, wow. and you're done. That's yeah. the whole thing. And the nice thing about these is, it's that footprint that so many people need in their homes because it's not huge. I mean, we have big, big racks. If you've got tons of stuff, absolutely. This is perfect for those jobs around the house, inside the house, yeah. on your porch, all these different places where you need a lot of weight capacity, but you don't have a lot of room. These are just perfect for that. People use and these for, uh, we, we use these for firewood racks, and you know, oh, firewood yeah. is heavy as all heck. Yep. And you can put, I mean, literally, you can put eight or 10 logs on e easily Easy. on each one of these racks. I mean, you're talking about putting two or 300 pounds. You could put up to 750 pounds. I mean, look at this. I love that you have the ob uh, the uh, the uh, uh, you know option to put the wheels on because sometimes you'll want to move it. If yeah. it's in a garage or whatever, and you need to sweep or dust or whatever, you can do that or down in the sure. basement. I also love that they're always off the floor. You have clearance underneath, so if you get any moisture in your basement or in your garage. You don't have to worry yep. about things getting wet. Think about it. Cans of paint. Maybe you're buying surplus stuff at the at the big yep. uh, big box store. Pavers, cinder blocks. Right. I mean anything like that. What's bags nice of about like these... bags of salt for oh. maybe for your uh, you know your water process. We had a woman last night call in who was talking about how she always you know she has big dogs and gets big bags of dog, dog food. food. These are awesome yeah. for moving those. Because think about it. Yes, it's for storage, but it can also help you move heavy things around the house. Now, one thing we got to talk about is colors, because we have oh, a yeah. lot of colors today. Sit down, relax, have yeah. a cup of coffee, Get a cup and of take joke. a look at the colors. Because <laughs> we're gonna go through these. And, and I want you to realize that that's uh, that only HSN could do something like this and offer you so many true. colors, because most true. retail will not give you color options on We anything. have colors, you so, want colors. We original? Have colors. Yeah, this is the pewter right here. This is the original pewter color. Remember, you're gonna get two. So no matter what color I'm showing you, you're gonna be getting two, but that's the original pewter right there, okay? All right. And a lot of people probably have that one. I'm gonna move that guy out of the way, and we're gonna start going to all these blue. other ones. Now, here's our blues. Let's have the other one. Okay, so this is your blue and teal, navy blue and teal. You'll get right two there. of either color. Yep, and you know what? I'm gonna grab this one too. This is our sapphire. This one's awesome. Yeah, let's put that next to it as well. So you've got your navy blue, your teal, your sapphire, and then back in our little alcove, in our little breakfast nook, yeah. we actually also have turquoise. Turquoise, That's yep. sitting back there as well. Great So colors. just another choice that you can get if you want, if you like your greens, plenty of greens for everybody out there. Okay, and there's your turquoise. So right. those are all your choices in the greens, all right? Now, let's get these guys out of here. And now this is our pink purples, okay? So this is gonna be our uh, blush. This is gonna be purple. Then we've got lilac and fuchsia. So blush, purple, lilac, and fuchsia, okay? So, so think about this too, like for a little kid's room, 
right? If you want to do your daughter's room and she loves pink or either one of those pinks, those are perfect for that. Oh yeah. Uh, we do this because we find more and more people love origami as industrial furniture, right, Lou? No, it is. It's awesome I mean, furniture. It's fantastic storage. Now these two, these are our neutrals. So we've got gold right here. It has kind of an olive undertone to it, but that's our gold. And this is ivory. All right. If you've never seen the never ivory, seen that before. It's, it's more kind of a buttercream color. That's really nice. Yeah, again, it's really you nice. know, thinking powder rooms and stuff like that, or if you want to do laundry rooms. Yep. A lot of people like the lighter colors for that. Then we also now, have the going ones around the back here. behind us. Okay. This is our vintage bronze sitting here right now. And the vintage bronze is the one that looks great with wood. It looks great with leather if you've got leather furniture. These are fantastic for those rooms. This is the sapphire that we saw a few moments ago. Nice. It's kind of a light blue. I really like this one. Almost like yeah, a cornflower. Yeah, flower. like a periwinkle, baby. Yeah, there you go. Right? All right. And then this, this one know, right here. I know. He's surprised that I said that. He knows well, his colors. Deep. Very, very deep, interesting. Deep, sophisticated. Uh, this is going to be our platinum right here. This is the one that looks very much like sterling silver. Uh, sterling silver. Listen to me, like I'm selling jewelry. This <laughs> looks very much like stainless steel. Uh, then we've got our orange. A lot of people last night were just raving about the orange yeah. because it's a really nice, subtle tone of orange. I love this one. It's awesome. It's not like over the top. You're not going to run this over the garage. No, right? you're not. You're you like definitely not going to see it a mile away. Yep. Yeah. Then we've got our classic black right here, which is, you know, of course, that's. So many people love this color. Sure. Um, and then the one I'm standing in front of right here, this is our red. And I'm going to kind of pull this aside. Now, you'll notice as I was going around here, there were some options on these. Like for instance, this one has the cover on it, and these covers are available. And we've also got right here the shelf liners, which people go crazy for. These have magnets on the sides, and they will stick to the shelves because, again, the shelves are powder coated steel. So you've got that. Oh, one color we didn't do, white. And that's all the way in the back in the kitchen. Yeah, I don't know if you can see that over our heads. Way back over there. But you know, it's cool, though, because you can see what it would well, look like white. in a kitchen. Um, yeah, we'll show that shot when we yeah. get. We're probably going to need our, uh, we'll do our, get our jib camera ready to go, and we'll be good to go. But it does come in white, too. And please remember, Everybody that orders gets two. Yes. The shipping and handling is only $5. We're taking a pretty good hit on that because you know to ship these out, isn't it? These weigh almost 19 pounds each. Oh, there, yeah. now there's the white. Now notice the baskets. Those baskets are available too. They hang right on the shelves and you get a two pack of those. So yeah. if you're interested. Yeah, grab it. All right, $89.95 for a two pack. Uh, shipping five bucks, $17.99 to get them home. Um, I know, uh, and I've told Lou this story a hundred times, but when I first came to Florida, I didn't, I didn't, my house didn't come with a garage, so right. I bought one of those, you know, outdoor. Oh, the plastic. No, I yeah. bought a shed. You yeah. know, at first I went to that, that shed company over there. I know them. Tyrone, you know where it is. Yeah, I know them. And I got myself a shed, and uh, and I love it, but there was no, there was nothing inside. It was empty, so I went and bought one of the uh, home store plastic shelving systems, and uh, that was just terrible. There was a million different pieces in the box. I had some leftover pieces. I'm talking about the shelving system that I had. And uh, it started to kind of melt out there. It started to sort of lean to the left. It was terrible. And it took me an hour and a half to put it together. What I love about this is the minute you get it out of the box, that's how it comes, right? See the wheels? You put those on. The wheels take two minutes to put on and you're good to go. I put the wheels on if you want to move it. If you don't want to move it, you take the wheels off. If you're putting it like as a permanent thing in your garage or whatever, it's ideal. Uh, we get people that use these for their kids' college dorms. Lou, you look silly. <laughs> what are you I doing, Lou? I feel silly. Lou has uh, created these beautiful one-of-a-kind paintings that he's right. offering. That's right. In addition, to, <laughs> these are the colors. In case you didn't just get that. In case you didn't just see all the colors we just did. Here they are in smaller versions. <laughs> I, I'm glad you did that. This was like one of those things they wanted us you to do. You should have seen me with a hacksaw sitting there cutting these yeah, things apart. Yeah, nice, Lou. All right, so yes, there's all the colors. And well, well, because we may not get a chance to go through the whole thing, although I think we probably will go through right. the colors one more the time. The platinum's a little cocky. But I, uh, the reason that, that, you know, it's so funny, when we first came out with these, we had one color. All right, it was the pewter color. That was pretty much it, That was right? it. For and years, it, that was it. Anyway, it was the model pewter color, and everybody loved it. It was great. But then uh, what we found is that a lot of people were like, you know something? I don't want to hide this. I want to put this in my kitchen. Yep. I want to put this in my laundry room so Absolutely. I can put my detergent and my various What about that weird little products? closet under the stairs? What, what about, do you do with that? Yeah, what, what kind of, you know, that, and see, that's the, the Harry thing. Potter closet. The Harry Potter closet. Yeah. But see, that's the thing. There are so many spaces in our home that get, you know, that we could store things. That we don't. That we right. don't for that reason. Well, for instance, all right, let's talk about the laundry room for a second. Now, I know a lot of people out there, we have, my laundry room, I always get around about this, but we have a special name for it. It's called the garage. Because my, my washer dryer is out in the garage. A it's a Florida thing. A lot of people garage. do. 
Yeah. But we, there's no storage out there other than like the things for my tools and all that stuff. So we have a little origami out there that we keep all of the cleaning products, the bleaches, the detergents. Cause you know, this is powder coated steel. So you don't care if it drips on this, it's not gonna hurt it. Now, here's the thing. We were talking to a nice lady last night about how she uses the origami rack, the small guy here to move stuff around through her house. Do you still carry in your laundry basket? Can I ask you why? When you could be putting it on here and you could just be pushing this throughout the house. So that's a nice place to use those. What about your kitchen? Because I don't care how much shelving, how much storage space you have in your kitchen. If you're buying kitchen electrics, like this big stand mixer right, right here, and you know, my, my wife Kelly, God bless her, did you have any of the cookies she made? They're up front. No, I didn't. They're cookies what, up what kind front. Did she? Where? There are cookies up front. My all wife right. made cookies. I'll be right back. So, all right, guys leaving. But my point being that if, you know, you like to bake and you've got all these different, you know, accoutrements, uh, you know, right. different machines. You don't you, see it. You, you won't them? use it. Exactly. Like, like, you the, forget you have it. You remember I was telling you a story about the paprika? When you, you know, it's like waffle irons are like yeah, that. Waffle if irons. you don't see a waffle iron, you ain't eating waffles. You'll go to the waffle house. That's right. right? That's right. You got to be able to see your appliances. <laughs> and, and that's what this is wonderful for. And you know what else is nice, though? I don't what? worry about the weight of my appliances. because. No, no, you don't have to. Anything. Well, and the nice thing is you can slide it around. So if I need to get access to something, it's great. Also great for adding room to a walk-in pantry. You know, it's fantastic for that, walk-in closets. Now, let's talk about the garage, because I have a lot of origami in my garage. And you might think, okay, well, why do you need the little one? Well, I've got windows in my garage. So I'm not right. going to block the window, the only source of light coming in there, right, with a big rack. I put the little guys underneath there. And I want you to see something on this one. We have right here three cinder blocks. These cinder blocks weigh about 30 pounds a piece, okay? So you're talking about 90 pounds on here. I want you to see something, how easily I'm moving this. And I am not even close to the weight capacity. Because remember, with the wheels on this, I can put 225 pounds on this, okay? Yeah. So the 90 pounds is nothing. And it's very simple for me just with one hand to be pushing this back and forth. It's amazing. Really, it really, really is. Easy. Yeah. Hey, really quickly, I want to put, put something in your head here, which is unbelievable to me. But this is one of the highest, <coughs> highly, highest rated products yeah. that we have here at HS. Yep. And I want you, it has about, <clears throat> I think about 2,000 reviews. Yeah. So I want you to think about this. If I took 2,000 people and I put them in a building, right. and I brought one of these out and put it in the center, and I gave every one of the people in that building, all 2,000, do you know that close to 1,900 never said happened. it was perfect? Yeah. yeah. Would that With anything happen? else, I would never have 1,900 no. out of, because it's like 1,850-something <laughs> out of 2,000. Out of that's crazy. That's it's like nice. a whole, that's like a whole, you know, it's a, like a basketball game and everybody in the crowd yeah. loves it. Right. All at the same time. I mean, and the reason I bring that up is because I know what you think matters to you. Like, cause you know, your fellow customers, you want to hear what they say. When I go online and shop, I look at reviews. I want to know, you know, there's certain things I may say, well, maybe that wasn't for them, but I'd try it. Right. But most of the time you're like, I want to make sure that people love it. Read the reviews and understand why we made it a two pack. Cause everybody, a lot of the reviews are like, I'm so glad I bought two. Oh, yeah. Because, I, you know, oh, now yeah. I have well, four. Well, that's why we started doing it. Right. Yeah. It's crazy. But anyway, people love, love, love no, this No, they product. do. Well, yeah. all right, so think about this. Something as simple as building a bookshelf, a, a tiny, tiny little bookshelf, or in this case, a little tiny entertainment center. That could be an all-day project, honestly, with all right. the screws and the glue and the, the, the instructions in Swedish and all the stuff you got to put up with. When you're talking origami, literally, you could set this up in just minutes. It says it takes one person less than a minute. I've done it in, in seconds. I mean, it's so fast. But what's nice about this is if you're somebody who moves a lot or maybe you've got a kid in college and this is the best furniture for that because you can set it up and take it down and you yeah. don't need to rent a van to move it. No. I mean, it's really, really simple. To do. And it looks good. I mean, no well, one would ever look at that and think like, oh, that's a cheap piece and, of furniture. And you know, my no. mom's in her 80s, okay? I'm sure. not going to send her a shelving system she has to put right. together. exactly. Because I know in doing that, who is actually going to have to right. put it together, which is Sonny Boy over here. This so guy. I know better than to do things like that. What's nice is I could ship this to mom's house. She could take it out of the box, open it up, put the hook on and she's got shelving, okay? Yeah, yeah. That's what's nice. Not all of us are 25-year-old, you know, uh, TV models. <laughs> we, some of us are, you know, either have the bad back or this, the other thing, and we're like, we need something simple. That's what you have with this. You have a simple solution in your choice of colors, and you will utilize it for everything. You know, there are people that go and spend thousands of dollars on installing, like, shelving systems in their, in their garage. They'll, they spend all that money when all they need is a little extra space. They just want something to put their stuff on. They, they have, maybe you've got like, like with me, I've got like six, you know, a gallon cans of oh, backup yeah. paint. Sure, sure. In my house, and it's all listed, you know, from I know ceiling, the ceiling, walls, I know the ceiling. Like dining room, living room, bathroom. And if you put that down on the ground, that's gonna get nasty and rusty and bugs are gonna yep. get in there. Yep. It's gonna dry out, all that stuff. Put it on a rack like yeah. this and yeah. then 
And then you can move it with Move you it need. wherever you need it to. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, you can load this up with tools for jobs and roll it around the house, whatever. Now, what I'm holding right here, these are available as well. I highly, highly recommend these. This is the two pack of our shelf connectors right here. And I'm gonna show you how these work because these things are really cool. If you ever wanted to make like a whole wall unit, and actually we have one here in the studio, but I'm gonna show you how you can put one together. This is pretty cool, actually. These actually yeah. hook on. They have these little hooks on them right here. And all you have to do is just pick where you want them to go. They'll fit on any level of shelf. So watch this. What I'm going to do is put one on here like this and then slide one on this other one. Now notice those two are connected. That's so cool. Now I'm going to put them on the top just because I feel like doing that. All right. And look at that. So look now, at. but I want you to look at this. Look how solid this is. Is this not crazy? You want to see something even cooler? Watch this. I'm going to spin these. I around. don't think there is anything. Cooler. No, there's cooler. Watch this. All right. That's pretty cool. Now, when you, right? now, now, when you say well-made, does that look well-made to you? Because you know if you try to yeah. do that with any other product, try to looks. do that with a couple of shopping carts. Right. Watch them go <laughs> bouncing all over the place. Look at that. These are so well-made, and, and and that's indoors. Imagine this like at the at the back of your garage. Oh, yeah. And now you got all your stuff organized in the back well, of the garage. And I mean, this is nice because you could put a really big TV on here. You could put a fish yeah, tank could. on here. You could put so many, and if I didn't want this here, guess what? I'm moving it down, down there. here. So, you know, I, I'm not sure exactly which colors we have because it keeps changing. Yeah, yeah, whatever you want. So if you're buying these today, ask if you can get these. Inquire, see what colors they have. Yeah, all right. So let me again tell you what we're doing today. So normally this would be a 125 deal for two racks. Uh, we normally do these for like... I Lou, what is it like? Was it fifty nine ninety five? Was our deal when we did one of these? It used like 60 to be bucks. even when we did a today special before. It was at least ten dollars more than this. Right. At least. So, so what we've done is we've cut the price down. We've doubled up the offer. You're getting basically two for forty five dollars here. Yeah. I mean, you're getting forty five each. Crazy. That is. I don't even know how we do that. The uh, the uh, flex pay is only seventeen ninety nine. Um, hey, Lindsay, can, if they use this as their first purchase and they get an H cent credit card, can they take twenty dollars off? She didn't answer me. She said she's had I to think, think, she's she had to think about it a little bit. Yeah, and then she went, it. you know, they can't. So <laughs> if you want to get, no, she's because she's ahead of me and she was pulling up the ah. credit card already because she's that awesome. All right. So if you want to get $20 off the today's special and you're a new customer to HSN, just get an HSN card and you will be getting the best. You'll get a better deal than even customers that are already here. This is true. They can't use it. This is true. It's only when you first get your card. So grab it while you can. I am down to about three or four minutes left. All the colors are still available at this point. We're going to go through them one more time. Yeah, let's do them again. Because we know a lot of you are not just going to use this in a basement or a garage. A lot of you are going to put this in your house and use this as a pantry rack or a laundry rack. Absolutely. Or you're going to use this to put your shoes on or your hats or your or your boots or your pocketbooks or whatever Great it is you're going to put on it. Yeah. So let's go through. This is the original. So this is the original, the pewter color that we started the whole thing with. Okay, so let's see. I'm going to put oh, this over here. I, go I like there, to keep them close where to me. Where am I winging it? Like the, over that oh, way? That way? Yep. So All here's right. our blues. So this is going to be our teal. Here's our Navy guy, you want to grab the uh, sapphire yes, behind you right friend. there? The periwinkle? Yes, the periwinkle. <laughs> so, navy what are we blue, calling it though? Sapphire. It is sapphire. Navy okay. blue, teal, sapphire. That's these three. And then in the back, of course, in our breakfast nook, we have the turquoise as right, well I'll available for you. So, I'll put your many, many choices back. today in colors. And there's that beautiful navy blue. Let's get that out of here. I almost, right. said, I almost said cornflower blue. What do you think about that one? I actually, I think that's what I said originally. Is that yeah. what you said? Yeah, it kind of hit me like that. Yeah. yeah. So we got our blush, we got our lilac, we've got nice. our fuchsia, and we've got our purple. So these are our purple pinks. Actually, he did a really good job of going down in the gradients yes, here. Yes, in the So scale purple, of... fuchsia, uh, the uh, lilac, and the blush. Beautiful. Yes. Many, many colors today, guys. You know what's funny, though? I don't believe we have a lot in any one color, so. Right, right, Because right. I know last night we had a couple more that aren't here now. Wow, and we will keep you posted as to All when right. they start getting limited. So, so our neutrals, here's our gold, and here is our ivory. The That's, gold has a little bit of an olive undertone. And the ivory, is that a new one? That, yeah, yeah, well, I've we've had it for a couple months, but the okay. ivory is more, to me, it's like a buttercream. I haven't done an origami show with you in a long time. I haven't done so. an origami show in like two I months, know, so, there's, so there's that. Okay. Um, okay, so this guy over here, we showed you a moment ago, is the sapphire. This is the platinum. Different than the pewter. This one is more like a stainless steel. Here's right. that fantastic orange. Love the orange. Yes. Uh, then we've got the classic black. And then next to that, we've got the beautiful red right there. And then, and and then of course, a, this is a bronze. Oh, over that's here. a vintage bronze. Yeah, yeah I forgot bronze, that was there. Then we got the vintage just kind bronze. Of a deep, deep, deep brown color. And then the white, which is behind us uh, over there. So, uh, if you want to get it, remember flex pays only seventeen ninety nine. Um, and uh, there you go. There's that There's white. The white. Crisp the, and clean. The white is right kitchen. next to my head. 
<laughs> I do that because my the director gets mad. I know she does. She, but she doesn't really get mad at me. She just we pretend. like to tease Rebecca. Anyway, uh, all right, we have about a minute left, so best value of the day. I think, Lou, you have another presentation maybe coming up in, what, like an hour or so? Yeah, like, like 10 o'clock-ish, sometime in the 10 o'clock right, show. Um, if you haven't picked it out, and there's a reason that I always say, if you've never shopped with us before and you're, on, and you're thinking about this, I will tell you, go for it. This is the perfect first item purchase for you at HSN. If you use our credit card, you'll get a discount. It's everything we're about. It's ease, it's simplicity, it's well Strong. made. Uh, you're gonna you're gonna want more, so we give you two. You'll ship it to your house. It's all put together. I mean, all the things that you dread about traditional retail with having to go and shop oh, yeah. and pick it out. Build. I, yeah, buy, none I, of that. I bought some stuff there that you have to put together. It's not fun. It's a commitment, man. Yeah, there's a it reason really that they is. hire people to put grills together That's for true. You. That's very, very true. <laughs> you don't want to have any leftover pieces. That's you? right. This is going to be the easiest, one of the best purchases you ever made because it is so simple, it is so strong, and it over delivers, I feel, on the product. It's fantastic. Yep. Lou, as always, you did a wonderful job. We appreciate my it. My pleasure. Uh, this is my last uh, show until after holidays, so I wanted to make sure. Merry Christmas. Christmas, candy, buddy. Candy cane. <laughs> I'm just going to hug you after, Lou. Here. Um, here's one for anyway, everybody. Anyway, I wanted to wish everybody a happy holiday, safe and happy New Year as well. I'll see you on the other side of New Year's. I'll continue shopping. The lovely and talented, beautiful Miss Robin is coming your way next. And she's got, what do you got, kitchen? <laughs> Cooking up a storm. That's why it smells so good in here. All right, we'll be hanging around to hang out with Robin. Have a great year, everybody. See you. Good morning, everyone. Happy holidays. I'm your host, Robin Wall, as Guy just shared with you. I'm going to be with you for the next three hours. We're going to do a little shopping. Maybe you're kind of putting the finishing touches. Maybe you're wrapping. I hope you'll join me because we're going to be in the kitchen this hour with Ming Tsai. We all 